Throughout my GT5 Facts and Glitches series, I constantly showcase out of bounds glitches. These allow you to go inside places that you're not meant to, or even get under the map entirely, and there are a surprising amount of them, over a hundred in fact. One question I'm constantly asked is, does this out of bounds still work in Grand Theft Auto Online, as many of the out of bounds in single player have been fixed over the years by Rockstar? So in order to answer that question, today we're going to be playing a game, where I will be presented every out of bounds glitch in Grand Theft Auto 5, and I have to decide whether I think they have been fixed or are still broken in Grand Theft Auto Online. Out of bounds glitches have two advantages beyond mere novelty. The first is potentially getting into spots advantageous for PvP, the second is visiting the interiors that exist under the map. For those unaware, all the interiors that you are transported to after a loading screen exist under the map at all times. As a general fix for people reaching these interiors when they're not meant to, Rockstar has put a large death plane below the map. Thankfully, this is removed when you're on a mission, giving you access again, but this isn't Rockstar's only fix, and the rest still remain even while you're on a mission. Rockstar has added additional collision on some of the out of bounds glitches to block them, or placed individual death planes upon them, making it so you die instantly, or at least before you can pull your parachutes. So this quiz will ultimately focus on whether or not the out of bounds from single player have been directly fixed by these methods in GTA Online. So this is the Out of Bounds near Mr. Richards, one of the first ones I think I ever showed. I wonder if they're in chronological order for my series. Is this Out of Bounds fixed? I would assume so. It's like one of the most obvious ones. Uh, I'm going to say yes. The reason why it says 1 out of 37 here is because the quiz is broken into multiple parts. Oh, nice. What Out of Bounds is this? The middle Out of Bounds? I assume that this is so out of the way that they wouldn't have fixed this. Because you, like, sure, you can go inside of the bridge and you can shoot out, but like, why would they fix this? Oh, yeah. Yeah, well, like, why, why would they fix this? Like, it, the odds of you using this in some way to get an advantage against people online is like non existent. Uh, oh, the one under the water here. This is definitely fixed. But like, obviously, this is so close to the city and stuff, they'd stop it. No? Well, I guess there's not much you can do under here, I suppose. This one as well is so out of the way. Like, you fall in this little gap here. It's at the dam, so, like, who goes to the dam? Uh, no. You climb in here, right? And you can go in the building. Uh, I don't, can't even remember if you can shoot out of this one. It's in the middle of the city, but you need a car to get to it. Like, you can't drive a car into here. I'm assuming a lot of these out of bounds were fixed like a long time ago when the earlier PvP stuff in the open world was more of a prominent thing when everyone didn't have a goddamn oppress or whatever. I'm still gonna say this is not fixed, even though it's not super accessible. Yeah. Can you shoot out of this? Oh, you mean, you, obviously you can with, um, like a. Snap rifle and stuff. Because snap rifles you can shoot through walls. Why wouldn't this one be fixed? It's so easily accessible. At the canals? Yeah, I'd say this is fixed. Yeah, okay. I'm getting the hang of it. I think this is going to be me repeating some of the same logic over and over again. This is a movie studio. Who goes to the movie studio? I mean, it's not that out of the way. It's in the city. I'm going to say yes. I think this has been fixed. Ah, oh. no it has not. This out of bounds is just going inside the strip club. Oh, through here? I mean, you just get inside the strip club, right? I mean, if they're gonna fix any out of bounds, why wouldn't they fix this one? It's in the middle of the city. Really, I just wanna put no for all of them because it's Rockstar Games and they don't fix shit, but I'm gonna say yes. I mean, well, I mean, if you can't shoot out of it, it doesn't really have any practical use, so I guess that makes sense. Okay, there's no way in hell this one has been fixed. To access it, you need a huge vehicle. I suppose with the amount of flying vehicles in the game now, obviously a lot of these out of bounds have become redundant, but yeah, I'm not saying this has not been fixed. There's no way. Oh. <laughs> Why would they fix that? There is no way in hell they didn't fix this one. Out of bounds where you can drive vehicles into? are uh, very uncommon. This one definitely been fixed. Easy, 100%. Is this just the convenience store one? Yeah. It'd be very useful if I could remember all of them that you can shoot out of, because you'd assume the ones they'd care most about are the ones you can shoot out of. 
I mean, you guys are saying no, I'm gonna say no as well. How do you get this one, right? You, you climb here or something? I think this is just one where you fall out of bounds and you get nothing out of it. So I'm going to assume that this has not been fixed due to a lack of any benefit to doing so. Oh. What did you even get out of that out of bounds? Maybe you could stand there, maybe you don't just fall. So this is just going out of your vehicle and through the wall. Given that you need a particular boat at a particular speed and to dive at a particular time, I don't think they go out of their way to patch this. So I'm gonna say no. Yeah, the more finicky and hard to do, you know. So I know for a fact that this one is fixed. When I talked about it, someone in the comments was like, um, actually, that has been fixed. You can't go out of balance there anymore. I was like, yeah, I don't do GT Online facts and glitches. It's GT5. It's not been fixed. Wait, no, wait, I said no! I meant yes. There's only two buttons and I pressed them incorrectly still. I'm going to assume that this one is not fixed. It's underground. I don't think there's any value in going out of bounds here. So yes. No, no. I mean, no. It's not being fixed. I was correct. They actually unfixed this for some reason. Weird. This is like one of the oldest out of bounds. I'm pretty sure people knew about this like, like day one, basically. Does that mean Rockstar would have fixed it? Would Rockstar be kind enough to leave this because it lets you go like behind the bar and stuff? I'm going to say they didn't fix it because Rockstar are nice and would let people have fun. Dang. So maybe the rule is like the earlier the out of bounds was accessed and understood by the player base, the more likely it was to be fixed. But I don't know enough about GT Online lore to know which out of bounds were discovered first. I don't even remember this one. Oh, this one. <laughs> there's, there's no way they fixed this. It lets you inside a little box. Well, again, it's still in the middle of the city, though. It's just, it's just something so overlookable. I'm going to say it's not fixed. Yeah. This one just gets you into the little parking garage, right? You need a car to access it. I don't think you can shoot out of it. There's no way this has been fixed. Yeah. Getting this little parking thing here. Oh, you can shoot? Rule of thumb, if it's fun, they fixed it. You need to dive for this one, right? Given that you can't normally ragdoll on command in GT Online and the up and atomizer wasn't there in the early days of GT Online, I assume that these ones that you have to ragdoll for probably aren't fixed. Because I think they were more keen to remove out of bounds in the early days where they cared more about small details like that. So I'm going to say it's not being fixed. Yeah. It's a big building too, like you get to see a lot of stuff. Which one is this? Oh yeah, this. Uh, I would assume this has been fixed. I think you can take cars in here. And for that reason, especially because it's just so easily accessible with vehicles, like, yeah, fixed. Wow, they actually put something solid there, not simply a death plane. They actually just fixed it so you can't go in. That's crazy. That is so rare. Millions to one. You need a car to access it. You're climbing out. I'm pretty sure you can stand in there. I don't think you just drop. It's not on like a heavily trafficked street or something. I would say this hasn't been fixed. Really? That feels so out of the way. Like, okay, that one surprised me. You can camp a clothing store, so it makes sense it fixed. I guess what I understand as having utility is not necessarily how someone in GT Online would think. Like, I don't know what was important when people were playing, you know, in 2015 for Grand Theft Auto Online. <laughs> so there will be some out of bounds where I'm like, what could you possibly use this for? And someone will be like, you need that out of bounds, man. You can protect yourself from X, Y, and Z. And I just went out. Is this not one that you climb? It's one that you warp into. I mean, I'd assume that the ones where you need to like wedge yourself and then warp in haven't been fixed because ragdolling is so hard to do in online comparatively to a single player, at least before the up and atomizer. So not fixed. Yeah. This is just an out of bounds one, I think, where you just fall out of bounds. It has no utility beyond that. So I'm probably gonna say it's not being fixed because it's just not interesting. Wait, so they put texture? Like, you can't actually go now? Another rare one. When I say texture, I just mean collision. So I mean, this one would be a good one to hide in because you can easily go in and out of it. 
did did I not get asked a question for this one? I didn't I didn't break it. It was no question. It's not my fault. I probably would have said fixed, honestly. You'll just give it to me in my score. Thank you, well. The benevolence. Can't super remember this one. I know you just climb here or whatever, but I don't know enough about this one to really assess it. I'm going to say yes, just because it's in the city in kind of the middle. Oh, but I mean, you had to reach it with a car. But I know you can, I, I, you can shoot out of this one. I remember that. Oh, uh, really? Oh, no, you can't shoot out of it. Yeah, so basically pointless. I'm surprised you even remember a majority of these. I guess I've just had to look at the facts and glitches footage quite a lot of times, and each out of bounds is super distinct. Yeah, so you run through the wall. I mean, you're already in it. Well, I suppose you could have like stopped at the frame before you died. And this one is so easily accessible. In the, in the direct middle of the city, you're just running through it. Easy as pie. Surely they'd fix this. What? Well, I, I Not fixed, by the way. I guess there'd be no reason to fix it if you can't stand there and you fall into the train tracks and die underneath. This is like super well known. This one of the police here. Probably one of the earliest found, I'd assume. And I think you can shoot out under here. You do need a car to access it, but I can totally imagine people sitting under here in the early days and just griefing the fuck out of people. Totally patched. Yeah, there's no way they'd leave that in. Don't you just fall through here into the parking garage underneath? You can't get a car into it. So I'm assuming this is not fixed. Like it just has no use at all. For real though, why? <laughs> Someone at Rockstar's like, I need to look busy. I need something to do today. Oh, that useless out of bounds at the freeway. We'll fix that today. I am working. Please don't fire me. <laughs> they did eventually fire me though. That's why they're not all fixed. <laughs> oh, just between the rocks, there's no way. There's, there's 110%, there's no way that they fix this. No, it, you, it's cool you can drop below the map and swim around down there, but you need to ragdoll. You need to get between specific rocks. I can assume that this is a very old out of bounds, but even then, I don't think they would have fixed it. Yeah, you swim around like a weird person. This is the parking garage, right? Look how specifically you need to climb to get here. Like you're not just walking into it. I imagine the vast majority of people do not know this one. You're on like the second floor. I don't know if you really get good angles shooting out of here. I'm gonna say not fixed. Yeah, there would be like 15 people and a dog named Steve who know this out of bounds. This one, I'm pretty confident you can shoot out of, but you need the car. I'm pretty sure you can't get back out once you go in. But again, this would be like one that no one knows about. So I'm gonna say no, not fixed. Because you'd assume that they target ones that cause problems. This one gives you access to the bridges that are under the ground. That's what makes this one cool. This is such an out of the way spot. I don't think you fall instantly, but probably wouldn't give you any advantage in online. As I say, because it's so out of the way, most people wouldn't know about it. I'm pretty sure this wouldn't be fixed either. Okay, they really don't want people in online seeing those bridges. <laughs> okay, there is no way they fix this one. This one is so finicky to get. You've got to get off the ladder in that particular spot and not fall through and, and get, yeah, there's, there's no way they fix this. Yeah, not a chance. Honestly, the more I go through, the more I get a kind of sense of what Rockstar is likely to fix or not. This is at that hotel area, right? The... I assume this is a hotel. I'm trying to remember what you can actually do with this out of bounds, and I don't think anything. So I'm going to say no. Yeah, you just fall, so no. Do you need to punch for this? But I'm assuming this is not being fixed, because it's, it's on a random building in a particular corner. Very inaccessible, especially in the early days where there wasn't as many flying vehicles or whatever. You'd be hard pressed getting here. So I'm gonna say no. What? You, that's impossible. Ow. I hit my hand. Im impossible. As a need to ragdoll for it, I assume it's not fixed. This is actually very hard to do. It, it took me multiple tries to get it. So there's no way this is fixed. I mean, I assume people actually go to this hangar a reasonable amount, so it might actually have some value a bit. Because you can't shoot people. This is just climbing into the freeway, Rice. So it would have no use. Could you, your head sticks out. It, it looks cool, but I'm gonna say not fixed. I am one with the pavement. Fear me, mortals. I can swim through solid objects. I know this one 
and I'm pretty sure it was well known. I mean, it's near the pier, so I assume there'd be a lot of traffic and standing in an entire building and shooting out would potentially be very valuable. I wish I could remember if you could shoot out of it. I'm gonna assume it has been fixed. Even got texture to fix it. No chance, no way has this been fixed. This is a pain in the ass to do, if I recall correctly. It has not been fixed. <laughs> He's having trouble even doing it once. See? And yes, and it's like, so what? You get under the water. It's like, who cares? I mean, it is kind of fun. And you, you fall swimming and stuff, but... He floating. Um... Oh, the, wait, the plant isn't there. Oh, no, you shot the plant away. I can see your bullet holes. It's such an easy one to fall through, but normally there's a plant there. So you have to shoot the plant away and then step on the spot in order to fall through. And so, no, they they haven't fixed this because, like, there's nothing you can get out of this, so... You know, your hand's gonna let go or... Yeah, so not fixed. Oh, it is fixed? Oh, because you don't have time to pull a parachute and, like, fly around. It kills you before you can do anything. I see, okay. Is it one you have to, like, wedge yourself between two walls? Yeah, so this one you have to, like, shuffle, shimmy in there. I don't think you can do anything with it, so I'm gonna say no, it hasn't been fixed. Look at him struggling to get in there. Yeah, there's no way. I mean, why would they fix this? Anything where you, like, need a car to get out of bounds, I think is just too much of a pain in the ass. But I suppose for people in GT Online, it's like everyone has a goddamn car, right? I think you can shoot out of this. I don't think they'd fix this, though. Damn, man. And I am correct. There's no way that they fix this. Sure, you can get inside this entire building, but, like, who the hell is coming up here with a car? Or something big enough to climb up here? It is not fixed. What? They put texture? They even removed the box used to climb into it? Okay, thinking about it now, I do remember doing the out of bounds and there was a box. There is no way that they fix this. It is a million miles away from anything. It's like whoop de fucking do. You can go out of bounds as random goddamn hovel in the middle of nowhere. Wow. Uh, I don't remember this one. I don't remember what this one does. I assume you just fall out of bounds. Maybe they would fix it to stop you from getting to interiors? Oh, okay, never mind. Not fixed. This is just going inside the boat, right? Why would they fix this? There's no way. Oh my god, the inside of a boat! This is sick! Gonna shoot so many people who, like, come to the dock to make out with people. Wait, didn't we do this one before? Both windows have an out of bounds? I completely forgot about that. And the other one wasn't fixed, so this one be, wouldn't be fixed either. Oh my god, bro, the exact same interior from before! Sick! Uh, this is the hospital, second floor, right? It's in the middle of the city, it's a place that everyone goes, but at the same time, like, no one would know about this out of bounds. Getting a car up here is a pain in the ass. Could you fly an oppressor into here? But again, oppressors came out so late. I I'm pretty sure Rockstar has stopped caring about out of bounds. I'm gonna say they have fixed this. No. That's flat. I think you do need a motorcycle to get to it. I just can't remember why. It's a finicky one. So I'm gonna assume it's not being fixed because it's so hard to access. Yeah. I mean, you can shoot out of it, so... I assume people would just grief people with that, but as they, just so few people would know about it. This is like way, way down there. Yeah. So this is like off the beaten path. No one would know about this. So I'm gonna say no. Has not been fixed. Can he not get in? They even put texture to stop it? It'd be weird for them to specifically fix this. Maybe you could access interiors under the map. Oh, this is the garage, right? Ah, I don't remember what you get from this one, though. It's in the middle of the city. It's a weird one to access, but maybe you can access online interiors under the map. I'm still gonna say no, though. I don't think people would know about this one. I assume that you could access something under the map then, because th that doesn't make sense for them to fix. This one is very easy to access, this one's very accessible, but you have to ragdoll and you fall through and... Yeah, I don't think they would have fixed this. You get nothing out of this. So I'm gonna say no. Yeah. There's no way that this has been fixed. It is finicky to fall in this little thing and you get nothing out of it. But, but wait, you, you, you're falling through it already. It is not been fixed. Yeah, so it's not fixed. Considering the other one at the airport was not fixed, this one 
Definitely not, because you have to like roll in a particular way and land on a particular thing. So not fixed. He's even struggling to do it. Yeah. No shot. This one's weird because I think you have to use a bike. It might have been that you can't get a normal car up here. And so in my original footage, I used a bike. Given that this is in the middle of the city, I'd assume they'd fix it. No, because it's so hard to access and no one would have found this. So I'm going to say it's not being fixed. Yeah. Like you're just getting into the roof. It depends how valuable the store would have been back in the day. Like were people like knocking over stores for money frequently? If so, you could like just sit in here and camp and kill people. I'm still gonna say no, I don't think it's been fixed. Yeah, it's just too out of the way. Is this the one underground? Yeah, it's a long run. It's just a weird step that you can kind of fall through. I can't imagine they would have fixed this. It's out of the way and you don't get anything out of it. Well. Is this one to fly under the map that people used to use a helicopter with? There's no way that this works. Because obviously they wouldn't want people flying under the map with a helicopter or any flying vehicle for that matter. So this is definitely been fixed. Yeah. Not many out of bounds you get a helicopter into. I don't remember what you get out of this one. But because it's inside one of these buildings, you need a car to access it. It's annoying to get a car into here. But maybe they would have put textures here when they remodeled the casino? It's the horse racing thing. Yeah, but, but they did a lot of remodeling here, so maybe they did fix this. I'm gonna say they probably would by accident fix this. Oh, what? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay. I mean, they were next door. I guess it doesn't imply they would change a bit. Still strange. This one, you fall inside the building. It's at the airport, so you'd assume that if they knew about it, they wouldn't want you to do it. Definitely kill some people here. But I don't think many people would have known about this one. And Rockstar generally doesn't fix stuff that people don't know about. So I'm gonna say it's not fixed. Can you not go in? Well, I guess it has been fixed then. It's even fixed in single player? Weird. You can get a car into this, right? You can legitimately drive a car through here and fall below the map. They would fix this. Fixed it. Yeah. Get a car in there, fixed. Uh, this is climbing through like a random window in a house, right? This wouldn't be fixed. Oh, you even have to rag on it? Okay, this is, this is, there's no way it's gonna be fixed. Yeah, no chance. No shot. Given that this is at, you know, the lumber yard or whatever, no one comes here. There's no way in hell this is fixed. I don't remember if you need the rag doll for it, but it doesn't matter. It's just too out of the way. Easy. This is near Floyd's and you just run in. There's, you, you stand in a building here, but like for what purpose? Like, I don't think Rockstar would have fixed this and I don't think many people would have known about it. I mean, it's a little bit hard to access as well. Is that fixed? Cause you die so quickly there. I assume then that you must be able to access some online interior. This one you have to ragdoll into. You can take damage going into here and die. I think this is a hard one to even survive. I've only included getting to two apartments in Facts and Glitches, and I think this one might have been the out of bounds to access one. And if so, they, Rockstar would have fixed it. So I'm gonna say yes. So not fixed. This is just an interior. Can you even go out of bounds from this one? Like, like below the map? I don't think so. I wouldn't think they'd fix this. He's in this little box and you, you can't even shoot out of it. So given the intersection that this is at, even though it takes a car to climb in here, they may have fixed it. I can't remember if you can shoot out of it though. Like that would really determine whether they'd fix it or not. But I would assume that they, I mean, who, who would find this? Who would know about this in GT Online? No, I'm gonna assume they have fixed it. I'm gonna assume. Fuck. Me, you can't shoot out of it. Yeah, it doesn't look like you can. No way is this fixed. This one is like convoluted as fuck, out of the way. It climbs stuff, climb in. I think you can fall below the map, but generally you just go into the water, so no, not fixed. That's super surprising. Someone find me the Rockstar dev that fixed this. I wanna know why. <laughs> With half these ones that are fixed, they're probably for reasons that I can't even conceive of. This one, that you have to climb two different things and you just get inside a random building. I don't think they'd fix it. But again, it is the canals, which I think people do use quite a bit. But still, no. No one probably knows about this one. 
That's really surprising. Maybe people do death matches on the canals so much, or at least they did back in the day, that everyone would know that little hidey hole. Isn't this hard to get into? Like you need to take cover and like shimmy yourself in? I don't think you get anything out of this. Over me out a parachute under the map, which I guess Rockstar wouldn't want. I still don't think it's gonna be fixed though. Most people wouldn't know about this. Yeah, not fixed. So far out of the way, and you just get inside the freeway. So no way would they need to fix this. So not fixed. Which is weird because you could totally sit under here and just grief people as they drove by with their stuff they're trying to deliver. But I guess maybe not enough people take this particular road. I don't remember what happens when you go in here. I'm gonna say no, it's not being fixed just cause it's kinda out of the way. No one would know about it. I mean, you can shoot out of it, but like, like who cares? That one guy who goes down that alley is gonna be so pissed when someone shoots him from there. There's one of the earliest deathmatch like levels or whatever is in this area. But I mean, why would you want to fall out of bounds in a deathmatch? Because I don't think you can stand here or anything like that. I don't know if a lot of people have known about this and it has no real utility. I'm gonna say no. Okay, you probably get to some online interior then. Don't you need a bicycle to get this or something? Oh wait, yeah, this is just when you walk through, right? And I remember being surprised it was so easy to access. Given how easy it is to access, but it's a random house. Now I'm gonna say I'm gonna say it's been fixed. Like people would know about this one. Yeah, yeah. If you can walk into it like you're walking into Mordor, you know, surely they fix this. Like it's so easy to get to. There is definitely a death plane right underneath this. Everyone would have found this. You're insane! Why would they not fix that one? The tree? It's too out of the way. There's, like no one comes here. Like wh who's gonna care about this tree? There's no way they fix this. The tree glitch, not fixed. Is that fixed? The death was really quick. There's no way you could parachute or something. Why would they fix that one though? Strange. Oh yeah, because you have to run all the way up here. There's, there's no way. If you have to run that far, no one's going to be checking out this random house. But I mean, if they fix the tree glitch, then it seems so random, the ones that they fix. I don't think they'd fix this one, no. No. Yeah. But why the tree glitch and not this one? Uh, this is the one where you go inside one of the white pipes or something, right? And this one is hard to do and you get nothing out of it. So I'm going to say no, not fix. Oh, you even have to rag though. Yeah, no chance. No shot. Yeah. Oh, you can fall out of bounds. Okay, well, maybe they'll fix that after this video comes out. Uh, doesn't ring a bell, this one. There are a handful that haven't been in the series that I wouldn't know. If you have to ragdoll yourself into there, there is no shot that it's been fixed. So I'm gonna say not been fixed. <laughs> 57 tries later. Oh, interesting. Yeah, there's a handful that will be here that I don't know about. All of them from this point on you don't know? I'm gonna be very interested to see them then. If you can fly an oppressor in here, and given the amount of stuff that goes on here, surely they would have fixed this. So I'm gonna say it's been fixed. Weird. Can you not go that far around? It's, it's too small? Can you be shot at as well? I'd assume so. There's probably not much of an advantage to this. You only got access to the building there, not out of bounds with an oppressor, so not as bad. I um, mean, if you're climbing a car, it's a random goddamn house in the middle of nowhere. I don't even know where this house is. Me, a GTA guess a master. No person who's played this game has ever seen this house before in the history of their lives, so there's no way in hell this has been fixed. It's a nice house, though. Oh, uh, if, if you're ragdolling for it, I'm gonna go against it. Yeah, not a chance. A hundred attempts later. If you land on the exact right pixel here, you can fall out of bounds. No chance. No chance being fixed. You did it. Good job, man. You're out of bounds. Oh my god. As I say, it's hard to assess when I don't know what you can get out of this, but like, this is so out of the way. I would like to think that after so many years of doing facts and glitches, the only out of bounds that I wouldn't know about are the ones that are really, really not well known. So I'm gonna say this is not being patched. Uh, he's, he's, he's having trouble here. Okay, good. <laughs> well, this one looks familiar. No, I know this one. It's the one you go down here. 
they might have fixed this. I think you can shoot out of it. And you, you're out of bounds for quite a while. You can go, you can swim under a lot of the map from here. I mean, you can't get a vehicle in there. It feels like this is a pretty old one, but I mean, if they're not fixing it by putting texture here, that's kind of weird. I'm going to say it's not been fixed. Yeah, it's a hard one to get into, isn't it? You can shoot at people though. See, I don't know this one, which is strange considering... Oh, okay, maybe not that strange. Oh, right, here's another one we have to rag, though. Has this been fixed? I'm gonna say no. Oh, no rag, though, necessary? Just a very particular climb? You could probably stand there if you were more careful. I'm surprised I don't come across more out-of-bounds people griefing online. I think it was more common back in the day. And perhaps when there was more easily accessible out-of-bounds. I mean, there are vehicles that can survive, like, 40 RPG shots, right? As if you're stuck in some particular box firing an RPG only at particular angles. Like, you hit him once or twice, who cares? Do you need the bike? I assume you need the bike, and that's why you're using it, because probably no other vehicle will fit there. So I'm going to say no. Not being fixed. Too easy. Have I seen this one before? I've been in this area before. Yeah, I don't think I was recording facts and glitches, though. Again, if you were right, wait, you, you didn't ask me, but I was gonna say no, it wasn't fixed. This looks familiar because there was a glitch where you could like clip it so someone getting out of your car would get stuck inside the building. If you need a building that tall and need to ragdoll, there is no chance this is fixed. Too easy. I've never been in this out of bounds myself, but I remember being submitted a glitch where you like end with a prostitute and she gets out of the car through the wall. This is across from Leicester's. Probably a fairly traffic place. If you're gonna shoot your shot at that wall to get in here, I'm gonna say no. Actually, I may have seen this one or something similar. I mean, this actually looks pretty valuable. Don't know this one. I don't even know where you're standing. Wait, there's, there's, there's a huge H? Okay. I thought you were going to take your oppressor into a building. Such a random little square. I'm going to say not fixed. Actually fixed? With collision as well. There's an out of bounds here? Is it just into the building? I'm going to say not fixed. It has been fixed? I guess because it's on a main road. Don't know this one. I guess you can clip into that. 800 tries later and definitely not fixed. Interesting one. Oh, is this just where you go through the clock? No, that's in the other part of the map. Are you going to go in the building with the oppressor? Why wouldn't they fix this? I'm going to say not fixed though. Because I don't know about it. So no one else probably does either. <laughs> I know everything except the things that I do not know. I mean, okay, there's just a small little hidey hole there. That's not getting near anything. Okay. This one I know, it's only accessible at night time. It only gets you in the store. Is that a bound fix? No. There's no way they fix this. There's stuff that prevents you going in during the day. What could this one be showing? I mean, it's like a main bridge. Why wouldn't they fix this? I again, it depends what you receive. I'm, I'm still gonna say no, because if I don't know about it, no one does. Okay. If you've got to chuck yourself at the bridge, there's no way they fix this. <laughs> what? How? How is this an out of bounds? If you grate yourself against anything, eventually some part of you will get into it. Wow, you did it. Good job, man. I mean, if it was easier to do, this would be cool. Out of bounds. What? Is this just the glitching of Los Santos Customs? Oh no, there must be some actual out of bounds here. Ah, uh, they would not fix this. There's, n there's no way. You need to ragdoll, and it's in a particularly weird spot. Uh... I've been told about this one, I believe, but I don't know it. No, not that guy. Is this out of bounds fixed? No. No. The up and out of Myers has just given access to a lot more out of bounds than I think Rockstar Polly predicted. They were like, but our collision, it's perfect. How can they find so many? Neato. I do not know this one. It doesn't look very easy. So I'm going to say not fixed. 
Okay, it's got a little hidey hole here. That's, 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 that's pretty cool. I mean, this is near something that we do with Keo Perico, one of the setup missions. It's in a more trafficked area, but you're using a car for it, so I'm still gonna say no. Yeah, you don't get much out of it. This one I've seen before, it's near the assassination thing, and you, you go on this little platform. This one may have been fairly old, like, people would have known about this a long time ago, right? I think they may have actually fixed this. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this platform is normally just not solid, right? This, you're just going into the store. Yeah, you just climb up there and you get nothing out of it except, like, you clipped into the store. There's, there's no way they'd fix this. What? 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 Why would they fix that? Well, I suppose it's like in the direct middle of the city, I suppose. I guess that was probably a very old one as well. I don't know this one. I mean, if he's using a particular bike, I'm assuming that he's going to wedge himself in here and then clip out. And that's just too finicky. Most people wouldn't use it, so no. An interesting one, though. Oh, sick. Well, you got to be in first person for this one? In a particular location, I'm going to say no. I do not know this one, though. Oh, neat. It was across from the clothing store as well. This one I've done, you walk into the corner. Uh, it's just a simple out of bounds. Given how simple it is, and it's a populated area, I'm assuming they would have fixed this. Oh, no, I guess not. I don't know this one. I mean, if you're climbing a truck to get here, is out of bounds fixed? I'm gonna say no. What? Staying in the area for more than 10 seconds kills you? Well, do you know what my score was? How accurate I was? I got 65% of them right. It seems Wells' keyboard is broken. He meant to type 100%. I am truly a master of uh, knowledge of the inner workings of Rockstar Games. You could say maybe I'm some sort of mole for Rockstar Games. Ratting on people with all their secret out of bounds. All of those that weren't fixed are going to be fixed by the end of the week. Con conveniently, just coincidentally, uh, not because of me. <laughs> You've given me all your secrets! You fools! See, that was fun. It was nice seeing some more Out of Bounds as well that I had yet to have seen. But I suppose those will be spoilers for future episodes of Facts and Glitches. But I imagine most people won't get to the end of this video, so it's not going to matter. If you did get to the end, though, thank you for watching, guys. Thank you for hanging out. And I wish you all the best. Boop.